Okay, everybody, this is going to be a BISC, which is Bader International Study Center from Queen's University dorm room tour. Because when I looked, I could not find one, and kind of important, you know, dorm rooms are kind of important when you're picking the university, you just want to know what it's going to look like, especially when you're coming all the way across the country, or into another country, sorry. So real quick, I'm going to show you what it looks like from the outside, and then we're going to get started. <laughs> This is one of the smaller rooms, but they're all basically the same size. So behind the door, there are two hooks, which we just have our towels on. So I've got my towel. They provide you with one towel and one face towel. Um, and then I brought my own. Same with my roommate. I'm just going to pan over her side of the room. I'm not going to go into it. And then she also has a desk and bookshelf. So, let's start with mine. So since our room is one of those smaller rooms, it doesn't have enough room to have bed, nightstand, um, cupboard, cupboard, nightstand, bed. So, my nightstand ended up being here. And then we have a full length in here, which is pretty nice. There I am. Um, so on top of it, I just have my laundry soap currently, and that's a uh, present. Um, in here I keep random things like my Halloween costume and my face towel. I have random stuff like school things in there and then that's where I keep my underwear and socks and stuff like that. For my desk, I just keep whatever shoes I have wearing that day there. That's my school bag. I already have craft dinner under there because that is needed when the food at your university is disgusting. Um, in this bottom one I also used to have food. I don't have that much in there now. Apple juice, um, craft dinner, cinnamon sugar, noodles, hot sauce, stuff like that. This is all school books, and then this one is like random like documents and stuff like that, so I'm not going to open that up. Um, we have a garbage bag, um, that's all recycling that I need to go give put in the recycling bin. And then this is the top of the desk. Um, one of my friend's moms made me oatmeal cookies, so that's what that is. And some change. They provide us with a lamp, which is fully sick of do. And then this is what it looks like. I've got lots of random stuff. I usually keep my laptop just there and the cord. That's my um, planner agenda. And then this is my bulletin board. Laundry stuff, pictures, things I've done my room key, stuff like that. And then up here we have our two shelves. So my pug dog, makeup, I've got some games back there, sunglasses, makeup brushes, toothbrush, toothpaste, some rocks from the beach. In here is like really random things like, what do I have in there? I don't even know. Band-aids, no clipper, um, flashlight, and roller, stuff like that. My English books, I have returned the rest of them. This is a library book. This is like all my tea. And then these are like some thank you cards and stuff. They gave us these scarves at the beginning. One of them somewhere has an emblem. There it is. So that's been sitting there because it's not my style. Um, I bought myself an advent calendar just to make myself feel more at home. So that sits up there. Those are some cards people gave me that are like out of season now. More cards. Back up here I keep my water bottles and um, my thermos. An address book. And then this is where I used to keep all of my textbooks, but I returned them all. Um, and they give you like 20% back when you return them. So, yeah, now there's just a gum container there. <laughs> On the floor by my desk, I keep my laundry bin. It says wash this on it. And my shower caddy, over here, has my shower shoes and shampoo and 
by washing stuff like that. This is the view from the window. It's kind of a gross day out. This is what England looks like. It's not a bad view or anything. Um, and then we've got my bed, which yeah, looks pretty hospitally. Underneath, I keep um, this is like a board game that me and my friends made. My suitcase and some random like duck hangers that I didn't need and um a camera case. The bed I always keep water in the book that I'm reading by my bed as well. These beds are really uncomfortable. And that pillow. We're just not gonna talk about it. Another window. These do open up but we have a light there. Um power outlet there. I just have my adapter plug in right now. And then this is my armor thing. I guess I'll show you in that as well. They do have key locks. Some of the other rooms came with keys. Ours didn't, and it doesn't lock, so. Yep. So down there I have a bunch of shit. It's like presents, and then my shoes, and my shoes are behind all those as well. So I just shut them in there. And this is my clothes, like pajamas, sweaters, more sweaters, more shirts that I don't wear anymore, and pants. Um, all the stuff hung up. And then on this door I have my umbrella and a scarf. And on this one I have my shower. Um, I don't even know, like a bathrobe type thing. And that is my room. So there's nothing on our walls because we're not allowed to like tape or anything. Um, yeah, so that's my room tour. If you guys want to see what the bathroom sharpener looks like, I would be more than happy to do that as well. But, yeah, so be enjoyed. Okay, hi there. So I'm going to film what our bathrooms look like. Excuse me, like, for we're looking like this. But I'm going to show you what my bathroom looks like. Most of the bathrooms do look the same here at university. I go to the University Queens, the broad campus. It's called BISC. Um, it's in England. Yeah. There was no room tours when I looked when I was considering moving here, and so I thought I would help someone out. And no, my room is not decorated it's super amazing or fancy or anything. It's literally to show you guys the bare minimum that you get is. So I'm going to take you to the bathroom now and do a tour of the girls' bathroom. So let's go. super old and don't work. Four showers, two, three, and four. What they look like inside of like this first room, which is like a curtain, and then there's a shower in there, and the store closes as well, and the showers don't work great, but yeah, and we keep going this way. Two bathroom stalls, clean and simple, um, window, and then three sinks and some mirrors. The soap smell very fresh. The hot water, they're not kidding. It says caution, very hot water. This is too hot to use and this is very cold, so. Yeah. And then this is just what it looks like. They do try to clean in here often, but it doesn't end up getting super clean ever. This is what it looks like. And then I'll show you down the hallway again. And then right here is the boys as well. It's not just showers, it's like all the bathrooms. Yeah. 